Whether it's studying for an exam or trying to remember your shopping list, might it be possible to improve your memory while you sleep? The question is, what determines which information is going to be kept and which information is lost? With support from the National Science Foundation, neuroscientist Ken Paller and his team at Northwestern University are studying the connection between memory and sleep and how it might be possible to boost how much you remember while you snooze. We think perhaps many stages of sleep are important for memory. However, a lot of the evidence has shown that slow wave is particularly important for some types of memory. Slow wave sleep is the deepest kind we get. All right, Susan, come on in. And what you're going to do is um, try to respond to these moving circles on the screen. Lab group members demonstrated for us two of the tests that they run on study participants. In one test, Susan learns to play two tunes. Blue circles are one tune, red ones another. Then sensors monitor her brain waves while she naps. One of the tunes she learned plays softly to her as she sleeps. In a second exercise, Ileana memorizes the location of objects as they appear on a screen. Each object has a signature sound. Again, her brain waves are monitored as 25 of those 50 sounds play back to her while she naps. In both experiments, participants who were able to nod off did a better job remembering what was reinforced while they slept. We think that memory processing happens during sleep every night. So we're at the beginning stages of finding out what types of memory can be improved and how large the improvements can be and what sorts of stimuli work. Paller's goal is to better understand the fundamental brain mechanisms responsible for memory. And that, in turn, may help people with memory problems, including those who find themselves more forgetful as they age. Paller says in the future, reinforcement techniques could be put to work enhancing how we learn. So instead of an all-nighter, we'll just sleep on it. For Science Nation, I'm Miles O'Brien.